Welcome to Daily Scripture Reading. I do not own the rights to this music. Deuteronomy chapter 27. This is the Amplified Version. The altar on at Mount Ebo. Then Moses and the elders of Israel commanded the people, saying, Keep, remember, obey all the commandments which I am commanding you today. So it shall be on the day when you cross the Jordan to enter the land which the Lord your God gives you, that you shall set up for yourself large stones and coat them with plaster, lime, whitewash. You shall write on the stones all the words of this law when you cross over, so that you may go into the land which the Lord your God gives you, a land of plenty, flowing with milk and honey, just as the Lord, the God of your fathers, has promised you. Now when you cross the Jordan, you shall set up these stones on Mount Ebo, just as I am commanding you today, and coat them with plaster. There you shall build an altar to the Lord your God, an altar of stones. You shall not use an iron tool on them. You shall build the altar of the Lord your God with whole uncut stones, and offer burnt offerings on it to the Lord your God. And you shall sacrifice peace offerings, and shall eat there, and shall rejoice before the Lord your God. And you shall write very clearly on the stones all the words of this law. Then Moses and the Levitical priest said to all Israel, Be silent and listen, O Israel. This day you have become a people for the Lord your God. So you shall obey the voice of the Lord your God, and do his commandments and statutes, which I am commanding you today. The curses of Mount Ebo. Moses also commanded the people that day, saying, These tribes shall stand on Mount Gerizim to bless the people when you have crossed the Jordan, Simeon, Levi, Judah, Issachar, Joseph, and Benjamin. These tribes shall stand on Mount Ebo to pronounce the curse for disobedience, Reuben, Gad, Asher, Zebulun, Dan, and Naphtali. The Levites shall answer with a loud voice to all the men of Israel. Cursed is the man who makes a carved or cast image idol, a repulsive thing to the Lord, the work of the hands of the artisan, and sets it up in secret. All the people shall answer and say, Amen. Cursed is he who dishonors, treats with contempt his father or his mother, and all the people shall say, Amen. Cursed is he who moves his neighbor's boundary mark, and all the people shall say, Amen. Cursed is he who misleads a blind person on the road, and all the people shall say, Amen. Cursed is he who distorts, perverts the justice due to a stranger, an orphan, and a widow, and all the people shall say, Amen. Cursed is he who is intimate with his father's former wife, because he has violated what belongs to his father. And all the people shall say, Amen. Cursed is he who is intimate with an animal. And all the people shall say, Amen. Cursed is he who is intimate with his half-sister, whether his father's or his mother's daughter. And all the people shall say, Amen. Cursed is he who is intimate with his mother-in-law. And all the people shall say, Amen. Cursed is he who strikes his neighbor in secret, and all the people shall say, Amen. Cursed is he who accepts a bribe to strike down an innocent person, and all the people shall say, Amen. Cursed is he who does not confirm the words of this law by doing them, keeping them, taking them to heart as the rule of his life, and all the people shall say, Amen. The end. God bless you and thank you for joining me today.